everybody, welcome to another Muddy Reviews. Figured since we're at it, we're talking about MTech Fluxes. Let's talk about helmet covers too. So this is an Emerson MTech Flux helmet cover. I actually picked this up from the Evike store when I was down there recently in a Grapevine, Texas. Dallas, Texas, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's not really in Dallas, it's in Grapevine. Anyway, I'm going to get off on a tangent. Picked this up for the helmet because I got the MTech Flux a little while ago and I was like, I need a cover for this game coming up called Corporate Wars Bull Market. You see that segue? You like that? And JTC Airsoft Field in Beggs, Oklahoma. It's a two day event, June 1st and 2nd. If you use my code MUDDY at the little picture with my faces popping up, you get $2 off your tickets at the link in the description below. Save that, use that money for uh, BBs or something. I don't know. Bull Market, check it out. Hope to see you there. Let's get on to the review. What like that? That was a smooth segue. Yeah, but I got this cover because of the event, Bull Market. The helmet's black. I could have ran it straight black, but I didn't want to. I wanted to look super cool Gucci. And I said, you know, I've been wanting multicam black stuff for a while. I have to have a black top half with my black uniform. Kit doesn't matter. I can wear multicam if I want, but my head has to be black and my uniform has to be black. So I opted for multicam black because it looks cool and it's going to be drying up soon from what I've been hearing through the grapevine. So I thought I'd start piecing it together where I can. This Emerson MTech Flux cover is pretty decent. Fits very well. I don't have any major problems with it uh, as far as fitment goes. It looks like it could be a little better. It's not as snug looking, as clean looking as the Agilite cover I saw. Can't find that in black anywhere. So I went with this guy here. I was going to get a Spiritus raid cover because I, th I thought those looked really cool too. But I didn't know if I would get it in time. So I decided to wait on that and get one later, probably another color, since this Flux is a black helmet. Things I don't like about this cover. There's no Velcro on the rear at all. I had to take some adhesive Velcro and just stick it on there myself. There is zero tie-down points for strobes or whatnot to dummy core them. So if I bump this strobe on something, there she goes. She's gone. What I'll probably end up doing is running a lead, fishing lead, a metal fishing lead to these tie downs here on the rail system all the way up to the actual strobe light so I don't lose it. And I don't have any good tie downs for my 31 case, the box back here, the fake battery box. I feel like this is just a little too weak. So I may have to try to rig something up for that as well, but I don't know yet. As far as the cord goes, running the 31 fake 31 cable, wasn't too bad. There's some space back here behind the rail on the flux. And we we're able to do that and then tuck it under the front half of this right here. There's two little Velcro points, uh, loops up here in the front. You could use those for little tiny flags. I've seen those. Actually, I think I saw that on the Spiritus raid cover. They had like a little IR US flag there. You could do that. You could just put IR tabs like these guys here, these little IR squares right there. You could also do specific IR tabs. Microbat Systems actually sells little IR tabs in different shapes, like circles, squares, triangles. So you could have some sort of IFF with your squad, where you put like a triangle on your left side as you wear it, right side as you're looking at it right now, and like a circle here. So they know if they see that, that is friendly. You know, so weird, little, little stuff like that. But I'm not going to go into that. And yeah, looks good. Coloration's not bad. The fabric feels like roughly like 500D Cordura. I don't know if it's real 500D Multicam Black Cordura or if it's just fake knockoff Chinese Multicam Black Cordura, but the coloration looks pretty good. Feels nice. Stitching's good. It's really well made for Emerson. Like I said, fitment is not the best, not the worst. It's somewhere kind of in between. It did go on a little challenging. It was a little hard to kind of get it to fit, to sit right, but once I got it on, it did look nice. It's like 15 bucks at the Evike store directly. Kind of can't beat that. Not a terribly expensive cover. If you have an Imtech Flux and you're looking for some covers, you're having a hard time finding them. Like they're all over Amazon. I was just wasn't really sure about those. And I've seen some on eBay as well. If you've got the money to spend all day long, get an Agilite or get the Spiritus. I do plan on trying to source both of those for this Flux over the summer. But for now, in a pinch, the Emerson will do you right. 
15 bucks won't hit their wallet too hard. 70 bucks is a lot for the for the raid this the emerson seems kind of like a bad clone of the spiritus cover i'll put it that way because the spiritus cover does have loop back here whereas this doesn't and i had to like i said i literally had to take some adhesive velcro and just stick it to the back of the cover and it's not the best adhesion so over time it's going to come off and I'm going to have problems. I could get in there and actually sew some Velcro on myself. But that requires my sewing machine not being bitchy. And I just don't really want to. If I could source some multicam black loop, I might in the future. If I do, I'll show you guys. But that's all I got. Hope you got something out of this. If you got an MTF, M M Tech Flux from PTS or a real one, and you are looking for a cover, especially a multicam black, do know the Emerson is an option. Other than that, Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys got something out of this review and out of this video. As always, get out there, play some airsoft, be a bunch of nerds, build some cool lids, work smarter, not harder. I'll see you in the field. Take care.